I'm Roger with Lion Technology, and these are this week's top stories at Lion News. First and foremost this week, U.S. DOT's Pipeline and Hazardous Materials Safety Administration has revised and updated its hazardous materials regulations in response to petitions from shippers, packaging manufacturers, and other stakeholders. We're talking more flexible rules for hazmat limited quantities, relaxed label specifications, and changes that harmonize DOT's regs with international and U.S. EPA requirements. That's not all, so check out Lion News for a complete list of updates. These HMR revisions take effect on December 7, 2018. Next, US EPA will publish a final rule to create new mandatory requirements for managing pharmaceutical hazardous wastes. Once finalized, the rule will create a new subpart in the RECRA regulations to hold new storage, shipping, and reporting rules for healthcare facilities and others that manage these wastes. Lion will provide an update when the final rule appears in the Federal Register, so be sure to subscribe to Lion News and stay tuned. And finally this week, the state of Ohio added three new items to its state universal waste program this year. If you're not already managing paint and paint waste, aerosol containers, and antifreeze as universal waste in the Buckeye State, doing so could have tremendous benefits for your facility and may help you minimize how much hazardous waste you generate each month. Thank you for watching. If these videos are helping you keep track of new and changing regulations that impact your facility, please hit the like and share buttons to spread the word. Let's see if we can get this video up to 50 likes. We'll see you next time.